today we're talking all about dancing right now and, and I think in the world of dancing we've been we've been served we've been told to step up we've been told to two-step but today we are stepping uh, we, we, we're stepping it out with a group called uh, Street Step is a project that was started and founded out of a dream that was called Keep the Dream 206 in 2003 it's been operating since then in 2008 it really made landmark when it became really really popular under the guidance of a young lady Margot Lawrence and she's here to tell us all about her dream which came alive in this and she has some friends that she's brought along welcome to the show Thank and you. good morning Good morning to you, young ladies. Hello, hello, hello. So tell me about Keep the Dream 206, or as you call it, KD 206. Yeah. When did this start and why did you feel it was necessary to have something like this? Well, the reason why we started was because I, I saw the need in the community. Yeah. And in, in my community itself and the surrounding areas. Yeah. So um, the kids always sat in the corner and did nothing with their lives, which this program, this, this project that I give in Delft and surrounding areas, gave them an opportunity to, to showcase their, their talents. Yeah. Like, in, if for example, dancing, singing. Like, uh, we get them onto platforms which no one else can do wow. in the space of the way we did it. Um, there's a lot of things that came out of the project that started from 2008, like, way back before that even. Um, so these kids don't just learn dancing in my class. They, they get the platform of performing on big platforms like wow. lot, of ex lot of exposure. L let's talk about that. Tell me about some of the highlights that you've had since starting off this project and where have you performed with your groups? Well, this, uh, for, to, oh, to start off with, we, yeah. we performed at um, the World Cup 2010. I mean, wow. That's first. Wow. We did um, the Cape Town Carnival yeah. for the last two years. We did, um, I performed in Parliament. We did a speech in Parliament for w w Women's Day. We did, like last week, we just did um, the Gymnastics, Inter International Gymnastics Federation. We did a lot of other pro programs like Artscape. We did Grand West Arena. We did um, cycle tours oh. and so many more. So, yeah. I really hope a lot of young people are paying attention and watching you keenly right now because this young lady is 22 years old and already she's achieved more than many could hope for. So, how, how have you gotten it right? How have you managed to get yourself to all of these high places, performing at all of these great stages? How? how? It's just a word by mouth. I mean, with Freshly Ground as well. We perform with Freshly Ground and Blackbird as well. They came out to my program to do like classes with them, like two-hour classes. Mm -hmm. I mean, they they there's a lot of opportunities where I, I don't know how to explain the way how we get out there. Yeah, yeah. Um, we just showcase what we love doing, and these kids' faces while they're performing just shows that they love what they do, and they just want to yes, sure. a lot yeah. of hard work as well. So this, as you were telling me, uh, Street Steppers is a project from KD two hundred six. Yes. Right. Tell me about Street Steppers in itself. Well, Street uh, Street Steppers as itself has grown from six dancers to about over 60 dancers wow. per class. So it, it varies basically, mm -hmm. but most of the time it's a full class. So I, I enjoy myself with Three Steppers and KD206 because it's, it, it helps each other in, in the sense of it, it works in, in one way, yeah. That's fantastic. And other projects that you're busy with right now? Um, we do camps, paradigm, sh uh, paradigm shift camps yeah. and programs, which means is we do um, uh, pregnancy p uh, prevention programs yes. and we do gangsterism programs we do camps where we take the kids out of Cape Town which, yes. which is Friedenburg or uh, maybe Titis Bay uh, where, where they normally have the jazz festivals uh -huh. so it's, we take the kids out of the situation and just give them something where they would it's a camp they wouldn't forget yeah so and you, you, you literally help them change their minds about yes. situations and how they, how they pursue life. How that they is, see life in a different eye, yeah. That is fantastic. Congratulations on Thank the you. fantastic work that you're doing and may you be blessed with just strength and strength <laughs> and strength to come. But don't go anywhere after this. We're going to see this, the fruits of, of the labour that this young lady has put in as a stepping out performs right here.